In this video, I'll show you how you can increase your Epic Games download speed. Just as you see right here, I have 50 MBs per second. And just with a few different methods, yours can be higher too. Now, I will be going over a few different steps. So please check the timestamps to see every step that I do. All right, so the first thing that we can do is close down our Epic Games launcher. Now, what we will do is go to our local percent of data. So in order to do this, go to the left bottom of your screen and here type percent app data percent. Then you'll see this file right here. So click on it. Okay. So right now you should click on the app data right here. So now you're in the app data folder and then click on local. When you're in local, we need to search for the Epic Games launcher. So here we have Epic Games Launcher, open it. Now open up save, then open config and then open windows. Now here we should see the engine.ini file, right click on it. Then open it with something like notepad. Normally this file should be empty. If there's any information in this file, press Ctrl A and delete everything. Now in the description, there will be a command that you need to type. So copy the command and then paste it right here. Once you've pasted it just like this, then press Ctrl S and save the file or go to file and save. Then you can close this down, close this down. And now we will go to the next step. The next step is to open up our Epic Games launcher. So what we will do is change a setting in our Epic Games. So go ahead and click on your profile at the top right of your screen and then go to settings. Now in settings, we, you need to enable tr throttle downloads. Here in throttle downloads, you can play around with how many KBs you would like to set. So first of all, you could try a hundred thousand. See how your, now please see how your download speed is affected and then play around with this. If you will set it on zero KBs, that means it's unlimited and that would be the max that you could provide. Do understand that if you enable this, and you make a lot of KBs, then other programs will run a lot slower. The next thing that we can try is to change the priority of Epic Games. So go ahead and minimize your Epic Games launcher. Then open your task manager by right clicking on your taskbar and go to task manager. In your task manager, go to details right here. Then search for the E and search for something like Epic Games launcher. So here we have it. Right click on it, go to set priority and then make sure it's on high. Change the priority, yes. And now go ahead and take a look if it downloads faster. The next thing that we can try is to change our DNS. So please close everything down and then do the following. Go search for control panel in your Windows search, open it up. Now go to network and internet, go to network and sharing center. And here you should see your connection. So in my case, I have the ethernet. So click on this one right here and then go to properties. So this will be your Wi-Fi or ethernet where you're connected here. Search for IPv4, click on properties and then use a DNS server. So Ep Epic Games recommends using one of the following DNS servers. So either type 8.8.8.8 .8 .8 .8 .8 and then 8.8.4.4 click on ok and if this one didn't work or didn't work as you'd like then we can try 1.1.1 and then 1.0.0.0 click on ok and close it down all right so the last thing that we could try is first of all download the game on an ssd there's a difference between a HDD file and an SSD file. On your SDD, there's a difference between a HDD and a SSD drive. On an SSD drive, anything will download a lot faster. So downloading games on this drive is a lot more favorable. Now, if you can do this, then we could also try the following. And that is to check the Epic Games status. So search for Epic Games status, and then you'll see status.epicgames.com. So click on this link, and here you can see every game and if there are any uh, incidents right now. So if it's all green, then you know there's nothing on the Epic Games end. Now, I hope this video helped you. And I'd say thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.